Bruce Blade! Hey, it's Bloodstained, Curse of the Moon. I try to do that like language that I do where it's like, I like slant every thing and I couldn't. Oh, you, were you mispronounced everything? I was trying to and then it just didn't happen. Curse of the Bl Moon. It it's Blurred Stern, Curse of the Moon. <laughs> yeah, it's too short. There's not enough in there. To, there's we're, nothing to work with. We're, uh, we're doing the sync in game here. Enjoy. We, I wanted to get, I wanted to game start correctly, you know? Um, so, I haven't told you what this is. This is... So, the this guy that mode. worked on later Castlevanias left the company that we don't say his name, and he made a game. This is not the game. <laughs> so, this is a game part of the stretch goal for his Kickstarter, where they said, if we get this extra money, we will make this, which is essentially a new Castlevania. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Like so a modern Castlevania? Was a man, or just another it's one? called Contemporary. Modern what's the, what's is a style. Oh, no, fuck that. Anyway, I'm not talking anyway. about art. <laughs> the, okay, the moon's cursed by demons. That man was Zangetsu. I like that name. Zangetsu? Getsu. Wrapped in criz, crimson garb with eyes like fire. He like relentlessly it. pursued the demons. Can you imagine? You're like, <laughs> you're so under the demon spell that you sort of turn it around on them. You just relentlessly follow them, and they're like, fucking guy just keeps... Well, yeah, the demons, they start fucking with you, and they start trying to us. work their way into your house, and then one night, you, like, jump through the mirror after them and fucking <laughs> chase them into their own realm. They're like, holy shit, man, this guy doesn't give up. He's dressed in all this red garb, and... He's got eyes of fire. He's got eyes of fire, man. What the fuck did we do? Bathed in moonlight, he cried out as he drew his sword, which consumed the darkness from within his wretched steel. I have All that night, either the demons or the moon itself would feel the wrath of his blade. I've seen a few people uh, where either they get like possessed by a demon or their identity gets stolen or something. You've seen this a couple times, have you? A cartoon. Oh, okay. A cartoon. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, the demon says, um, like the demon says, how do you live like this? Like, how do you live this life? It's funny. It's like, I know, it's hard. It's hard so, being me. This very first level is almost, like it's it's really Castlevania. I, the the later stages kind of felt like they did their own thing. What? What? What is the, the background's like flickering. Is that not supposed to do that? I don't think so. Is that showing up there? No, it's fine on that. Oh, okay. All right, I guess here. I'll just have to fucking have a yeah, seizure. epileptic attack. Yeah, that, that actually hurts. I really hope that goes away. <laughs> that's, uh, that's why we don't. This is why we don't record PC games, brother. But I don't know if this game. I should have checked if this game is on PS4. I'm just fucking. Idiot. Yeah, I'm actually surprised you didn't. Anyway, so probably multi-platform. You have come a, out recently. a sword instead of uh, which is the super whip. cool. But then the whip is one of the meta weapons. Like, but it, this is a. It, it, this only fires up. The whip. The uh, yeah, it only goes whip cracky in that direction. Ah. Okay, so I see. Back. I see. I'm knocked back. So you've got a whip. How? You've got a whip and you've got a sword, but they both have different attack ranges. So you have to. Yeah, but the the whip is like a is like a usable item. It takes some um, weapon points. Oh, okay. Yeah. A weapon score. I see that. Yeah. I see that. Is okay. that how the original game worked? Mm, yes. Not with the whip though. I mean, there was weapon score, yeah, but they were hearts for some reason. I don't know why. Just Ow. because Castlevania is about winning the hearts and minds of the people. Oh, oh! Yes. Apparently. So this, this is a that, that a rat was rat. not very effective. He's very confused. He just stays there. He's like, I don't know. I'm not really sure. Yeah, they're not. Yeah, they're not a very effective enemy. I guess they're to get you used to the idea that you can crouch. Maybe. Definitely. That's, that's to teach the player. Look at that Looney Tunes game Whoa, boy. you're teaching oh my God. the player. You know, I may be wrong about this, but the, I don't think he ever says learning through gameplay. Who? Aaron. Aaron Hansen? I don't think he uses those words. No, he doesn't. That's just something you've always said. So I came up with the term learning through gameplay? Yeah. Did I really? Because I honestly thought it was a famous concept, and I tried to find it, and I couldn't find anything on it. Nobody had anything on it. Really? Yeah. It was like the only the only learning through gameplay stuff I found was um kid stuff. 
like learning through gameplay, like oh, like oh, math circus. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's so not the same thing. Anyway, this explains that the purple um, lanterns drop items, so you okay. know. So you don't accidentally jump into an item you don't need. Look at that fucking meta. Look at that fucking meta. Because in the last one, it was random, right? It would just come out of one of um, those lanterns. It wasn't random, but they looked the same. What's this? That's what I meant. So you had to be careful. And I guess they just didn't want you to be careful. Also, a nice improvement to this game is that you can jump on stairs and make thing. Isn't that cool? Oh, instead of having to go to the bottom. In that, Castlevania, that is you had to like so necessary. You had to struggle over here and then press up and then hope that it like caught you. Anyway, you can't get past this guy without doing that. Like, without getting hit. Or, or so killing cool. him? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I mean, there's a train. I was wondering what you're a choo -choo. up to. Yeah. It's a choo choo. I mean, to be specific, it's the rear of a caboose, but whatever. That um, chandelier, why would it be. Shaky? Whoa. Yeah, why would it be swinging? So. The train's already moving. Cause, yeah, because it's a really shaky train, brother. Check this out. Oh, okay. Isn't that cool? That, uh... It's so cool! I don't think they do any damage, though, to enemies. I've tried that. So do they fall when you go underneath them? Yeah. And can you bait them out? Ah! Yes. Yeah, you can just keep going, actually. Just as long as you don't go back. Look at this guy. This... Oh, he's waiting for this you. Is a wolf. This is very Oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Fuck Yo, off! wall chicken, wall chicken. What? Yeah. No, wall chicken. I have found wall chicken, just... Not on this level. Hmm. Alright, next time. Wall chicken. You know, some people just Bring have it. like a crazy little attack where they thought the episode was over because you said next time. Yeah, yeah, we should do that. Or you say people as if people, it doesn't mean you. I did too, actually. I was like, should I wait the end? Yeah, for a second, I thought the same thing. I was like, man, is that... <laughs> Cancel the whole thing now? Look at this, dude. Look at this. Look at this. Whoa! What? Ooh. Do you know how exciting this is for me? To... <sighs> To, oh, to find a game with this much specific game design in 2018 is like an unbelievable feat. You, you have to go back to like the 80s when people gave a shit. Like something that I love about um, Wind Waker is that, uh, which I know pr proves the opposite of my point because it was 2000 and something. But in Wind Waker, there's a lot of enemies that require items to make them easier to fight. Like dudes that are like on fire, so you have to use the leaf to put them out and then attack them. And the leaf is also what you use in that dungeon. It's so cool. It's a very simple game. I don't know much of a Wind Waker though. I don't. We'll play it one day. We'll get there. I'll get really angry about it for 40 episodes. Uh, that was not the first 3D one though, was it? No, it was um... Link to the Past. No. Ocarina of Time. Okay. <laughs> Uh, but it was a 3D game? That was the first 3D one, yeah. Wind Waker was 3D, yeah. 3D as well, okay. That was the one that I just showed you. Oh, so it was Wind Waker's more... What the hell? Look at this guy! So, this is what... Like, you were saying the music's very reminiscent of Shovel Knight. So, this game is reminiscent of Shovel Knight, which is reminiscent of Castlevania-esque games. So, wait. That guy just... Oh, I see. I see. So he's eating all those blocks. I thought he ate his hand and then grew a new one with the material from the first hand. He's, uh... Ah! Oh, shit. Didn't he, see that one coming. This was really hard to avoid. Ah, ah, oh. You're just ah! hoping it doesn't land on you? I actually hit down instead of over. That's rough. Also, by the way, it's, it's classic Castlevania style. I do not just fight the boss if I lose. How... You have to go back and do everything else? Yeah. Ouch. Yeah, I love it. There's a difficulty option and like a setting for... I saw that. Casual versus veteran. Ah! I think it actually might be the same pattern every time. Because you think you got hit by the same fireball. Is it? I think so. I guess we'll find out. Dude, is that, does that lives mean... Uh-oh. We, we should probably should have played casual. <laughs> oh, is that what veteran means? Oh, no. Okay, lives is probably just the... the, the... In the level. And then you'll have to go back to the start. I thought it was the whole game. I was like, uh, I, I don't know. Because I, I don't know what it's what it would be like, like otherwise. That. You what? see how like, those guys are timed out so that I attack them and stop moving and then I get hit by the lantern. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fucking awesome, man. I love it. 
so careful few games. consideration. That's that's what you were saying earlier. Yeah. In so few words. What I called um intentional design or something like that. Uh, yeah. I, level of design, I think, was the word you used. Like this level of design. Maybe. Because it just seems like they've thought of things that don't always get thought about in games. The yeah. same way you can read some books that are good but they're just good. And then you read other books like Animal Farm and you go, wow, this book is fucking perfect. It has all the words it needs to have. It has all the sentences it needs to have and it doesn't have anything else. Dude, this book has all the words. It does, man. They're in there. George Orwell, the man himself wrote them. <laughs> but you know what I mean, right? George Orwell. What? That was meant to, that was meant to sound more like a or comma well. Yeah, George Orwell. Orwell. Or, well, what? <laughs> oh, that was so weak. Thank you. It was, uh, weak like it's... a young child. <laughs> <laughs> You're weak like a bib. So they give you the, the, the whip because fighting this guy with the, the dark portal would be impossible. Because he shoot it downwards. Yeah. Because he shoot it downwards. But see, what I like about this is that they've taken ideas and they haven't just been like, well, let's just redo Castlevania. They... Um, you have a sword, which has less of a, uh, what's it called? Um, Ring. delay. Oh. And then both. they gave you the whip, but made it at an angle, and then the downward, um, thing that used to be the potion does a, a, a consistent area of effect. Yeah, rather than, because the potion spreads out, like fire, right? Yeah. Whereas this one is, sits in a small area. I kind of think that's cool. I could have sworn I could do three damage in that time. You did last time. Hmm. I thought so, at least. He's, by the way, he's like grabbing asphalt and pumping it into his stomach, which is where he's getting the ability to fire things at you. Yeah, he's an unusual enemy, and he only has one arm, and there's nothing connecting that arm to his body, except for probably magnetics. <laughs> but I also love the, the, the way that they use um, bright colors to represent objects that affect you. See how his hand goes behind me and is dark? Yeah, and then and it then... becomes a lighter blue like the rest of his body. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, fuck! Whoa, sun. <laughs> sun? The, the the ground got brighter right as it became Yeah, right as he grabs it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna not risk gonna it. Not gonna screw it around, yeah. I'm not gonna risk it. I don't want to do this again, man. The people want progression. Ah! <laughs> You've actually been so lucky to miss that both of these times. <laughs> the, yeah, the animations were the really awkward. Oh! I'm, I'm really not a fan of uh, animations that aren't precise. I really don't like that when a hitbox is different from what you can visually see. That just grinds my gears. You know what really grinds my gears? People saying that? Um, this, uh, no. <laughs> not as much. I was going to come up with something, but I'm, I just don't... You're tired? <laughs> what, did you do hard work all day or some shit? <laughs> I tried not to say it, and I was like, fuck, I'm halfway through saying it. We already agreed not to talk about how we're tired. Yeah, because it's just gonna make us more tired, man. Um, I'm also just physically aching. My sho what? Okay. Oh, man. My shoulders and my biceps. They ick. Oh, no. Nice. Yeah, I got him, but it's not over. Oh, no. He's still gonna fuck me. Oh, up. no. Okay, watch this shit. Isn't that so oh cool? God. Oh my oh, god. There's so much attention to detail. That was pretty wild. So this was not developed by Igarashi. This was like revised by him. He's the guy who's like the father of modern Castlevania games. Not the originals. That's an important notion. He's designing the other game. Bloodstained Symphony of the Night. This is Bloodstained Curse the Moon. Okay, which so... Which is part of a stretch goal. So essentially right. this is a bonus because people are so into um, uh, Castlevania, but a certain company doesn't want to make it anymore. So other people have decided to make it for them. Uh, okay. Yeah. They I decided to... the next best option. Um, if only that worked with uh, Mega Man because that was one of the worst... Kickstarters in history. It was called Mighty Number no. Nine, and it was just a flop. It wasn't a good game. It wasn't a good campaign. A campaign, as far as like Kickstarter campaigns, 
Mm, mm. It it treated its um, the the backers poorly. It treated gamers poorly. It's just an overall. I uh, heard about that mighty garbage. number nine. Yeah. So was a game actually made? Yep. Oh yeah, no, it's out. Yeah. Um, also, it wasn't I, good. I can be someone else. I can oh. be a lady. She can jump higher. She's got a legit whip. And there are certain Ooh. weapons that only she can grab, and certain weapons only. Um, I, I forget his name. Luke Zenzu. Dude, yeah. this is pretty wild that you can just at will switch between yeah. these characters. And just go shaba. So I, I can jump, and it's like she can jump high, and I could be in the air as Setsu or whatever his name is. That's pretty. Yeah, that that's pretty cool. I like that creativity. Look at these guys. Remember these guys? Dude, oh, it looked like you had a shield. Because the way that water is sitting, it looks like you have a force shield right nice. now. Nice. <laughs> oh, it's moving with me. Cow oh, it's stuck on me. Get away. I really Get wish away. that this was like a thing I could do. I can't go in here, though. Looks like I can. It does, yeah, it really does. That's um, just the way their texture so is we're, done. <laughs> we're now past what I've played. So, uh, this is what we call a blind let's play. We used to do a lot of blind let's plays, didn't we? Yeah, that's why. Wasn't Shank and Shank 2? Sucked. <laughs> Bro's play never sucked. See, I, this isn't completely blind. I can tell what this game is going to be from what we've already played, so I was confident going into it not having played it. Hey! Um, we used to just go into games and having no idea whether they were going to work for a let's play. And... Oh, yeah, this Wait, is did my we ancestor. release those two human episodes? Yes. I believe we did. Yeah, we played so. two human for I think four episodes or something like that. Yeah, and it was so hard to play because you know how you attack in that game use With the, the right stick. stick. Yeah, <laughs> it's brutal. <sighs> oh man. Yeah, ah, I, don't, I don't miss what the fuck? playing that. Ah. Oh, oh, I got a knife. Mmm. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, you think you got shit with your spear? Come over here, taste my whip. Hearts. I like how hearts actually give you health. Yeah, that was the most confusing thing about Castlevania games. Hearts don't give you health, but chicken does. What the fuck? <laughs> that was perfect. That is exactly how he says it. You know, whip, 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 whip in every direction. Whip it good. Does he say that? Yeah. I believe... Yeah, yeah, I believe so. If he doesn't say it in the, the original version... We're talking about sequelitis, by the way. Oops. Uh, but we he, if he doesn't say it in the original, he says it in the one about Super Castlevania. So there was an arrow up there, and I thought that was where I was supposed to go, so I went the opposite way. But this way is going forever, and so... That is on. the greatest trap in gaming, is thinking yeah. you're going the right way, so changing your direction. It does look like the right way. What's up there? I th well, because I can only jump up there with her, so my guess is this is just an, a, an example. An example? That's how people talk. Example. Egg sample. Egg sample. <laughs> 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 oh, see, the downside of being tired is that, like, I'm just not quick, you know? Like, I'm a much quicker um, normally, which is such a bullshit thing to say as a, you mean, as, like as a creator. You're more quick witted. Frog. You see that? Yeah, they do look, they kind of look like frogs now. It's a legit frog. Look at that. With the eyes. Yeah. I just took damage to show you a frog. So it must mean you love me, bro. Or I just like frogs. What were you saying or about... I'm very impressed by frogs. Well, you were just talking about how it's no excuse. Like you, just... can't, you can't say, like, I'm normally oh, better than this. Yeah, as a creator, to say that I'm normally good. <laughs> well, especially because we're choosing when to record. We're right, choosing yeah. when to upload. Like, no one's coming you... to us and saying, hey, these are your options. Take Dude, it or leave it. That's a person. That's a person. Oh, shit. There is a little... Oh, no. That's amazing. Oh, fuck. Both my things go up. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Dude, the whip. Oh, like her regular Yeah, whip. the other girl. I'm an idiot. There ah! you go. I'm buying there Asian go. rings for my arcs everywhere. Easy peasy. Can you move me there? Um, no. Oh, so you do have to... really do have to think about them arcs. And cha! Oh, cha! Nice. Except I have none left. I like badass knife moves, though. Oh, I see. You gotta hit her while she's out. Okay. Yeah. I see. Easy. But now I got easy. the stuff back. <sighs> yeah, you gotta stop. You gotta stop using that. <laughs> that was great. There you go. Whoa. Thank you. You tried to juke him and I did, and it he, didn't work. He juked me back. It was a double juke. 
It was, uh, it was, a, it was a two juke. Juke squared? Is it, uh, I don't like that. No. See, now this is the right way. Now I didn't go the other way. Fuck it. <laughs> also, there's multiple endings to this game. Multiple ending. Yeah, because you can choose not to get people. I'm pretty sure I could have avoided getting her and done the whole thing with uh, Kitsu. Really? Yeah. Did you get her at the end of the... Oh, you picked her up. Right. She was the purple yeah. spear thing. Exactly. Kind of weird that the en that Ow. the enemy... Ow. Oh, that was it. Just kind of gave you back a kidnapped friend. Uh, Yeah, sure. Or is it another spirit? How does that work? I have no idea. Whoa, why is she dark? Oh my god, she died. Is that what veteran means? <laughs> Do you just lose people? Oh, this guy has lives, but nobody else does. Fuck. Well, I don't think we would have used her quite as much if we knew that. I mean, what the else fuck am I supposed to do? <laughs> Jesus. That is really hardcore. Fuck. And then go boom, but fuck off. Oh my god, you're right though. You just gotta get in at the right time. <laughs> that was the right time. <laughs> that would not, that's when I would have gone. <laughs> um, oh, oh, okay. Oh, no. Okay, so I died, so I got to come back as him in the checkpoint. Oh, so the life counts for both of them. Okay, that's, okay, that's much really less cool. Yeah. <laughs> that is very, very cool. I can appreciate that. Fuck, I don't know. I just wasn't thinking about what he does. I'm not quick-witted right now. Yeah, stop blaming, uh, stop blaming your, your moment, bro. You yeah. gotta live in the moment. I do, not actually. Let it stop you. I live so in the moment that I have a hard time planning for the future. I can definitely sympathize with that. I think a lot of people can sympathize with that. Don't give me sympathy. It'd be easier for me to not change. <laughs> yeah, I don't need your pity. Yeah. I, uh, I've noticed I, I went on vacation, and then I feel like ever since I came back from vacation, like, I suddenly... I'm finding it so much harder to eat well. Since you got back? Yeah. That's really weird. Well, because the vacation throws you off like your normal routine. And then getting back into the normal routine is like what never happens. What if... Ah! What if, um... This guy is straight out of a... Out of like a JRPG. Wow. A what? A JRPG. Japanese RPG. Oh. Look at me! Well, look at me with my swingy staff thing! That's pretty, pretty sweet cool. boomerang size. Switch over to this guy, smack him with that. That changes everything. Wow. I can hit those! <laughs> nice. Except I should probably play <laughs> got you with, that one. with my food. Ow. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Love tap. Ex excellent gameplay. <laughs> oh my god. Do you have different health bars with each of them? I don't know. And is that guy your checkpoint? No. Yeah, I think he might be. No, those guys just like, maybe. Yeah, I think he might be your checkpoint, bro. Jesus, it's like impossible to do this without her. Her, yeah, it's so true. It's a good thing she didn't lose her altogether. Yeah, that would have been tough if we just never played her again. We'd probably have to restart. I feel like that would be pretty much impossible. Especially with the enemies. Yeah, I think they've gotta be. So switch from him to her. Yeah, she has less life than he does. Oh, look at that. So I wonder if that means they have separate health bars. Um, like if her life is low. Oh, interesting. Should check that Too out. Too bad I'm not gonna take any damage this time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sweet, okay. Wow. So that allows us to absorb a little damage. Oh, brother. There's a delay, which no one's ever thought of before. Yeah, that has never been done before. The problem is that you're pretty much doomed now. Oh no! The mouse has been here the whole time. All right, well, whoever is on the bottom right editing corner. this, make oh. sure you take that out, okay? How, you just put something over it? Yeah, yeah. you take okay. the, you match colors. I'm sure I'll, this will be my um, playthrough anyway. Yeah, I'm yeah. Just, this guy's just kicking my ass here. Oh my God, I spend my days getting angry at Aaron Hansen for bad video game, and then I come home and I do it myself. It's really hard to play a good video game and be entertaining at the same time. You just tried to pull a Mario. <laughs> He's a slow moving guy, all right? Oh my God. All right, this could be over pretty quick. This better not be the end of the game. This better not be the veteran option. Oh, oh yeah, I see what you mean. Okay, I got, no, I got this. <laughs> you definitely need to be more strategic. Fuck you, fuck you. Ah, one of them hit. 
Like my favorite moment oh. in that in that film about going to the back to the to the future. Where the arrows hit. Oh, what is that? A bit time travel? No. It's called Gerard Butler's Lost Ear. <laughs> is he losing an ear in that? Yeah. And it turns out he's the guy that they were like un uncovering. Oh yeah, I can do that. I forgot about that. Oh nice. Uh, you haven't seen Arrival yet, have you? No. Arrival's like a dope. Man. I heard there's like a, a sick kid, and I was just like, I don't need that right now. Oh. What the fuck? Yeah, it's a big old axe. <laughs> wow. Uh, yeah, that's a very good point. Arrival is an incredibly sad movie. Uh, but you see how long that guy just stood there? Well, yeah, he's, he's got to be slow moving. He's made of ice. No, but he was like, he was doing it really fast. Oh, see, and then I gotta go. Jump. Oh, that's badass. Oh, okay, that's pretty badass. I like that. Yeah, he like he delayed his attack like Dark Souls. Yeah, he does. Dude, this game is the Dark Souls. It's a Dark Souls mania game, yeah. literally. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay. Little girl, big axe. Jesus, man. Uh, yeah, I uh, w when you're in the mood for something that's gonna make you really sad, you should watch. You yeah, watch it. in the mood. I'm never in the mood to be sad. Well, but you watched Snowpiercer. I, a long time ago. And you're probably going to watch it again at some point, yeah. right? Um, maybe. To make a video about it that other people have already made. Okay, so do you want me to just tell you what Arrival's about? Maybe that'll even pique your interest? Oh, it's about aliens and they don't exist in a normal form. So does that mean yes? Don't tell me what it's about. So you I mean, might still I mean, give it. me like a synopsis that doesn't ruin the story. Mm, can't be done. It's just it's look like at this sea turtle centaur. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. What the? F oh, what am I doing? Whoa! I can play Battle Kid. <laughs> Battle Kid. You don't know what that is. It's no. like it's one of those. It's just a completely unfair. It's, it's like you have to just okay, learn. Okay, no, I've seen that. You have to learn how to play it. Like you only beat it really by just like playing it, failing, and then avoiding that thing next time. It's Trial like, and error. It doesn't yeah. fairly display information like this game does. Actually, so far I have zero negative things to say about this game, and that is such a rare thing for me to have nothing bad to say. Yeah, so far it's really been doing good. It's just you that hasn't been doing good. <laughs> <laughs> it would appear so. Uh, Get down, motherfucker! So yeah, there's no Ooh. no real way to give a, a synopsis without giving away how it works. But the aliens are really badass because they're um, heptopods, which means they have seven limbs. That's really cool. Yeah, and they speak with this smoke language, so they make physical rings of smoke in front of them, and that's how they speak to each other. They put on airs? Yeah, they, <laughs> they put on airs, man. That's how they communicate. By the way, They're very um, airy. the way that lives work here is that um, I didn't have all my health. Yeah, you only started back with the health that he had to begin with. Yeah. Which is interesting. Better sweet. It means the last life. Or, I mean, there might be another life after the live I'm hoping, yeah, I'm hoping this is zero. Life zero. That is so strange. He's like a turtle, but, like, because he's a centaur he, and he's a turtle, he sticks his body out where the head would, like, a turtle would. Yeah, it's oh, really yeah. weird, man. This is so well designed, this whole, that whole, um, thing there. See, this, I have no fucking idea. How, what the fuck? Am it's I supposed three to do? sets and then you gotta move. I gotta get, get the fuck out of there, eh? I got him once. <laughs> oh, is it the only time we've hit him thus far? Yes. Oh boy, this isn't gonna go well. Uh, I do like how when you get down to this last life point, it's anything. Getting breathed on at all will take you down, so you just gotta be flawless. Is he breathing in his hands? Is he cold? <laughs> is he a cold turtle? Oh! He's an ice turtle, so I don't think so. Get on the thing and walk! Okay, two, three. <laughs> what do they like show up where I was? I think they do, yeah, they seem to. I think you just gotta. Yes, we do get a zero life. Yeah. Guys, it's so strange for us to be playing a. a... Ah! These <laughs> fucking I forgot where guys. I was. <laughs> oh, they turn. They turn around. No, they don't. Oh, I can do. I didn't know I could do that! I didn't know I could hit fast enough! I 
Okay, maybe I can't. Yeah, these guys, I don't like these guys. I don't like these tri-arrow bastards. The way that they, like, constantly fire is super fucking annoying. There you go. Stopped. Stopped in place. I found recently that I'm not watching TV or movies anymore. Really? Yeah. Oh. I think it's because I don't have as much time. I feel like I, when I do have time, I want to spend it working on the channel or, or doing something else like that, trying to be productive. That's cool. Almost. But it's just crazy because there's all, there's more and more and more TV and movies available. And people are constantly talking about the new TV and movies that they're seeing. I wouldn't worry too much about it because, um, like, you'll just eventually like want more content and suddenly you'll have all of this. Whereas for me, I actually have, like, a hard time finding it. Good point. That was a very good point, but it'd have a surplus, I suppose. But yeah, I just I, work. I don't know how he works. Okay, okay. I just find when it's been like when to sit down and watch something for two hours, I can do so much else in oh, I, two hours. I'm not really a movie guy for that reason. Uh, okay. I just don't like to commit to the same story thing for such a long period of time. Yeah. But yet you'll probably watch like three episodes of a TV show in a row. Right. But I can. It's easier, it's easier to quit. Yeah, it's, it's true. easier to stop at any point. Predefined breaks. I've actually just gotten really good at being okay with watching a movie in three parts. It's the only <laughs> way I watch movies these days. Yeah, I'm pretty good at it, dude. So how does this work? Like that? Oh. Move. Oh. Now where'd he go? I don't know, because every other time he clobbered you. <laughs> what the fuck? Ah. Oh, man. Well, that kind of worked, actually. Such useful magics. I thought you got hit. Is that how people... Oh, fucking... Oh, oh, oh. I say the same as the crossblade. Oh, fuck. That's nice, working nice. pretty well, actually. I wonder if you can catch it to get some of your magic back or something. Okay. Duck like this. That's so cool. You gotta pay attention to where the things are falling, and then you gotta get them on them real quick. Because that's the distance you need to jump. Oh, that's what you need to jump that height. Yep. She might be able to jump over all on her own. He came down at an angle. That was unfair. I'm glad that he doesn't try and stomp you again, because he'll probably get you. No, no, switch guys, switch characters. Yeah, there you go. You're gonna have to stay as her, I think. Ah. Whoa, that was narrow. Okay, you do still have power left. Each, I think yeah. each thing actually does different amounts of, uh, takes different amounts of weapon points. Each different weapon? Yeah. Next time we might just have to be more careful about what we pick up on the way here. The crossblade uh. was really good, but we definitely don't need that purple orb of doom. I might actually like using the um, axe. That's a good point. Smash him over the head. Oh, that was narrow. You have a narrow guy. I'm just that kind of dude. Oh, no, it's different. Oh, no, it's the same thing. Oh, Jesus. That is really hard to get used to, that that, that whip. The delay? Whip. Yeah. Isn't it basically the same as the original Castlevania game? Yeah, I, don't, I haven't played a lot of it. Oh, okay. I admire it a lot. Yeah, hey, he's trying to send out the bubbles. That's oh, really? Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. No matter how many bubbles are left, he always tries to shoot them out. I'm surprised he doesn't just stick with that death ray all the time. <laughs> just like the, the rock's still coming down. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Just... Oh. Mm. I don't know how well this is going to work. You're going to need the whip. So definitely avoid what these guys. Fucking guys. Oh. Games like this I find can be very frustrating where... I don't know what it is. I don't know exactly. I know. joined without the whip. <laughs> well done. <laughs> well done. <sighs> yeah, I don't exactly know what it is, but games with very precise models and hitboxes and very definitive health numbers i find yeah, some bad like it's not that i don't like them i find them very unforgiving it's really hard to get onto those those little ice chunks because yeah because you have a you have a set distance you can jump it's it's not it's it's you don't let go and get your points back your point or whatever i don't know what i'm saying what i that is the second time that's happened where i fired in one in the wrong direction 
Yeah, that thing doesn't last very long, considering the fact that it's immobile like that. Ooh, that's bad. That was working pretty well. That was actually, yeah, that was effective. I have one health, though. I gotta say, yeah, it's pretty much over, though. But don't get it that excited. Oh, yeah, okay. I'd actually, I guess it shouldn't be that much of a downer. You don't want to end the first episode on a failure. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> and we're at zero lives, so we're going to find out what uh, happens. Yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, change to casual and return to the game. Oh. Start don't... from the beginning of the stage. Not the game, the stage. I think for the game... I think with... for the video we casual, can play casual. Yeah, I think that's I think, fine. I think I'll be a filthy fucking casual. <laughs> uh, stock can be changed from loading the game. Do you wish to change? Okay, right, so I can just change back? There's, there's not really much of a... It's about how you want to play, bro. Oh shit, we still have to start from here though. Oh yeah. Alright, so thank you for joining us. Um, Next time, stage two. Sorry for not satisfying. Next time, casual! Yeah. <laughs>